I ended up getting kicked out of my uh, primary home around age 20 for it being that my parents no longer accepted me for my sexuality. I was never really able to open up to anybody personally about my life. You know, being homeless is very difficult. People don't understand most of the trauma that I've gone through was because of being homeless. I've been like beat in the streets and stuff before. I've even uh, experienced times in my homelessness where I wanted to, I was suicidal. But coming back to these people that work here, I kind of feel like it was a blessing to see some of their faces sometimes. Housing takes a long time. It's like 200 some odd days before people can get housing the first go around. And there were days where he was like, it, it doesn't matter. There were days when he said, I don't deserve this. I kind of feel like I've never really had anyone as supportive as my friend's place. I've been able to benefit really a, a, a lot of my life, you know, from the help that they've given me. Just recently in the past couple of months, he moved into his own apartment. Caleb was the caseworker that I worked with that helped me get into the long-term housing that I ended up getting into. He has his own unit, his own cooking area, his own bed. Um, and sometimes you take that for granted until you see how excited and pumped up these youth get. Kayla came to my apartment earlier and she was said that she was proud of me. And so I was like, why is she so proud of me? And so I kind of feel like that kind of experience was something really to uh, kind of treasure, you know? It's allowed me really to kind of like build myself back up to kind of have confidence in myself how I used to have confidence. I never would have thought like, you know, after all this time that I would have even gotten a chance to even be able to be housed. I think one of the most important things that we do here and we need to continue to do every day is celebrate each victory because they don't have that. They don't have people to say, you did a good freaking job. Being housed and stuff after uh, so much trauma, I kind of feel like it's given me a lot of relief. My friend's place ended up being able to bridge so much of what was taken away from me for me to finally reach my happiness, you know? So I kind of look forward to whatever it is that life has for me, you get me? Because I kind of feel like no matter what, nothing's really gonna stop me, you get me? Even if it's something that's like a barrier. So I had to really appreciate uh, all the help.